All right, guys. It's been a while. Man, what is it like to even bounce on the trampoline? I don't even remember. I feel like I lost my goods. If you don't lose it, you use it. No. If you don't use it, you lose it. Seriously. Oh, oh come on. I'm winded, man. That's weird. I'm like out of trampoline shape. Even though it's a trampoline and it should be easier than the ground, it's still just kind of different. And it's like, you know, if you don't use it, you lose it. So same thing here. However, um, I've been here before. I haven't been on the trampoline, you know, in months actually at one time. And then when I went back on it, it came back within like, honestly with like a day. So I'm not even worried. So I'm just telling you guys this because if there's anybody out there who's like, oh man, I can't do this because of, you know, some reason, am I going to lose all my abilities? Like, you might lose it temporarily, but muscle memory comes back quickly. Anyway, sales pitching time. So you guys were asking me, uh, some of you guys were, like what are these socks right here? Like what am I wearing? These are Skybound Grip Socks. They actually sent them to me. They're pretty nice. So speaking of Skybound, they actually gave me a discount code that any of you guys can use if you want to actually purchase a trampoline or I believe anything. It's Pygmy 10. Yeah. <laughs> You use that code and you get 10% off your order. So you use that code on skyboundusa.com and you'll get 10% off your order. If you're looking to buy a trampoline uh, from them or I guess any year, if you wanna save 10% off, just use that code. Anyways, yeah, you guys already know this. My trampoline's a Stratus. I always have a link in my descriptions to what my equipment is, this camera, this lens. If you guys are asking that question too, the trampoline, what else do I always put in there? It's always in my equipment. My camera, my lenses, my drone, my trampoline. Look at the trees out there. All right, what's up everybody? So it's actually a new day today. Um, one thing I kind of realized when I was reviewing some of this footage is I was acting like a little strange. I don't know if you noticed or not. Maybe I just am always kind of strange, but to me, I was like a little bit like woozy yesterday. And um, something I found out, I looked on my weather app and the air quality index for this region was 147. So just so you know, air quality index is measured, you know, like zero to 500, 500 being like toxic, right? And usually for it to be healthy, it should be under 50. That's like, you know, normal air quality. It should be under 20 for crying out loud. But um, two days ago, when I filmed the first part of that video, when I was able to jump on the trampoline, uh, it was 147, which is unhealthy for sensitive people. That's how they rate it. But in my opinion, it's just like, why is it even that much? You know what I'm saying? They recommend when it's that high not to like go exercise outside really. And you know when like my eyes itchy and stuff? So I'm wondering like what, maybe that was like affecting my performance or whatever. So if anybody has allergies or if you're noticing maybe you're not feeling well, maybe just, and you don't know why you're like, I don't feel sick, but I don't know what's going on. Maybe just check the air quality index. It's kind of alarming. Anyways, headed into the gym, gonna train, hopefully work on some new stuff. Hopefully my moves are still okay. Aside from the whole air thing, I'm a little heavy today, 190. Uh, I was kind of hovering around like 187, 188, but I ate a lot over the weekend just cause I was hungry. <laughs> Good part of that though is like 95% of it was whole healthy food, but I just kind of ate more calories. You know, it's getting cold. I'm thinking about maybe trying to put on some weight, but yeah, you guys probably don't care, you know. It's usually not a good idea to put on, like, too much weight if you're trying to, you know, keep flipping and, like, breaking and stuff. My eyes itchy, gosh. All right, come on. Yo, let me show you some new shuffle steps I've been working on. Let me know if you guys want me to maybe make, a like, a five-minute tutorial on these. 
obviously I'm not that good. I just learned them, but um, they're little variations of the Running Man, so I don't know. Then I get like the moonwalk right in, so right in like this. Moonwalk. See that? Did that work? Did that, did that work? Make a five minute tutorial on those maybe one two all three in only five minutes i don't know all right i gotta get training Man, I'm feeling thick. Maybe it's more than two pounds, or maybe it's just like two pounds of blow. So I've been going for about an hour. Um, I'm gonna do some legs. I'm gonna do a leg day of bodyweight beast, but I'm actually gonna modify it. Instead of just doing regular bodyweight squats, I'm gonna do them jump squats, because uh, I wanna work on a little bit of power, a little bit of explosiveness, because tomorrow I don't know if I'm gonna do many flips, but I, I still wanna have like a b-boy session tomorrow, so I'm gonna kinda refrain from the upper body today. That was a modified version of day 19. That took um, about 25 minutes, but I went really fast, but I'm out of here now. What's up guys? So um, back from the gym, I actually uh, didn't buy a bar today. So today I actually am going to make an experimental protein shake with almond milk, this uh, new protein powder that I want to try. Well, it's like a new flavor. This organic uh, plant-based protein sport from Garden of Life. 30 grams of protein in the packet. I want to try it. The chocolate one was good, but I want to do vanilla because I want to mix it with uh, these dark sweet cherries. I don't know, plant protein with um, fruit other than bananas, in my opinion, always turns out kind of chalky. But we'll see. About like two cups of almond milk. It smells all right. It smells like a vacuum cleaner. I don't know if that makes sense. Like a new vacuum cleaner. I always like to mix it so it sticks less to the sides. Now I'm gonna put the cherries in. Oh, look at all this. Maybe like half the bag. Well, oh, there's only two servings per, per container. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. It's still a little chalky, but it's actually 
It's all right. You know, it's pretty good. It's actually, it's actually not bad. You know, it's better than I expected. We'll put it that way. Honestly, my favorite thing is frozen bananas. Like you, you peel them, you put them in a bag, you put them in the freezer, you let them freeze. And then honestly, frozen bananas, almond milk, and really any protein powder, it just blends really well and it's creamy. You know, I haven't had a protein shake in actually quite a while, so this is my first one in a while and it's not bad. All right, folks, it's a new day if you cannot tell. Let's try this again. Come on, man, you're better than this. Oh, man. Yo, if I miss this, shoot, that's probably what's gonna happen, dang it. Maybe I should make like sock balls. <laughs> Neighbors, you just feel sucked. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope it was uh, entertaining. I'm sorry if it was kind of all over the place. Hope you guys had a good time watching it though. Don't forget to subscribe. More videos coming out this week. I got some hack videos coming out. Um, Resistance bands. Stay tuned for that. Skate coming this Sunday. Peace, y'all. Have a good one. I'll see you all.